Hello and welcome to VRML3. I'm your host, Luke. This is my first cast. Alongside me is Knight, uh, the spectator, and cameraman is the ever-famous Spucknet Cobra. And our analyst today is Kit Catastrophe. Our match is Spectral versus Adrenaline. What do you think of today's match, Knight? Well, I've seen a lot of these players in pub matches and in privates, and I'm interested to see how they play with their own team and how coordinated they are compared to how they are in privates. Um, right now, Adrenaline is on a four-game win streak and looking to keep that alive, although Spectral has lost three out of their last four games, so they're looking to bring it back and get some wins on the board before the end of the season. So I'm excited to see how, to see how these uh, teams duke it out and finish it up. That's awesome. Kid, anything uh, you're looking out for between any of these teams in particular? I am looking to see how like the NA playstyle is because I am OCE, so I'm very used to how OCE plays. So it's very interesting to see the differences between regions. That's for sure. I, I'm really interested to see how uh, if uh, the, you know we can keep up that win streak. Um, I, I, uh, I'm certainly not going to be biased, but I'm a, you know I'm a sucker for for you know competition and and keeping it ongoing. Um, Knight, do you have a uh, who do you think's the favorite coming in uh, from the community? Um, I've definitely seen Adrenaline as a favorite of a lot of teams, especially in the chat. I can see a couple of teams rooting for Adrenaline, but uh, they were cast or uh, sorry, coached, or, uh, coached by uh, Dash and uh, someone else. I forget who that was, but they were coached by some popular players, and their player base kind of floated towards the team. So Adrenaline definitely the popular team coming in. Spectral looking to upset. Spectral for the upset. Hey, who's who's a fan in chat with the uh, underdog story, right? Let's see what Spectral can do coming into this match. Cool. Looks like we have Spectral readied up. Let's see if Adrenaline uh, can let us get, get the Adrenaline pump in here, if you know what I mean. Um, but maybe that's a bad pun. A bit of a uh, something in the corner there. I don't know if uh, camera can zoom in on that, but they're having a little party on the side or something pointing each other out someone it's fully zoomed in it's fully zoomed in i see it <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely how uh, every team should warm up i mean i guess hey kit for some uh, oce analysis is this how oce teams ready up as well you know like punching each other just getting all riled or just a weird uh, with with OCE, it's generally like we, we do crazy stuff like just all out punch wars and it, some pretty crazy stuff happens in OCE. Like during pauses, we'll go and whack the disc a bunch of times or punch each other. We, we just muck around and have a good time. So it, it's nice to see that we're not the only ones that do that because I think it's honestly some of the funnest stuff ever is just Honestly, just having a good time, mucking around, friendly competition. It's good to see. Yeah, I think that's well said. You know, well, uh, you know, we're very competitive here with VRML and in our own respective teams. I think at the end of the day, it's most important really just to have fun and make sure you don't take the game too seriously. Uh, I mean, what do you think of that, Nate? Um, I don't know. I mean, yeah, it's definitely good to see that, but... um. Not much else to say. I mean, I'm looking forward to seeing these two teams play. Hopefully, um, we'll see Adrenaline ready up here soon. Cool. Um, we have... Do we know the main, uh, common main rosters for these teams? Are there any uh, subs playing in today, or is this all the main guys? Um, looks like, at least for Adrenaline, I know that is the main roster. Um, not sure for um, Team Spectra, though. Definitely pull that up. Ooh, let's see. So uh, for Team Spectral, uh, let's see, Dracon is a sub for their team, and they're uh, missing Spider OO um, on their main roster, so they're playing with a sub, and then uh, Adrenaline is playing with their entire team roster. So not only the underdog story, but we also have a sub filling in. Let's see if they can pull it out. I am really hoping they can. I'm a, I'm a sucker for it. Mm hmm. Definitely. Yeah, let's. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You can go. 
All right, so I mean, hey, I mean, uh, we're all also open to commentary here. It's uh, Knights and I's first cast. Kit's a little bit more experienced, and obviously the uh, famous Svetnik is more experienced than all of us combined. Uh, we're happy to, you know, hear your feedback, but more importantly, we're, uh, you know, here for some enthusiasm. So if you want us to hydrate, you know, make sure to release those in chat and all the other uh, shenanigans ongoing. Um, anything to add there, Knight? Yeah, definitely. Chat is one of my favorite things apart about, about streaming, really, is just getting to interact with chat and, you know, talk to you guys. So it, that's what I love about my channel. It's what I love about casting. It's what I love about Twitch in general, really, is just being able to talk to you guys and um, interact with you guys. And that, that's, what, that's what really is motivate me, motivates me to cast. Um, at least for me, I don't know. What about you, Luke? What what motivates you to cast? I just like and... the ex yeah, no, great question. I just love the excitement of the game. I I really think Echo is you know just the beginning to grow and just beginning to start really getting more you know mainstream. And uh, as the shenanigans we can see in the arena right now are going on, that's really why I love this this game and seeing what can go on in the space. Uh, one thing I want to add is a um, um, part of my. Uh, Oh, we're readying up. All right, here we go. Yep, Let's we go. see what they can do. Woo! First round. Adrenaline taking the headbutt down to the other side of the field. Focus looking to pick it up. Does not get there. Dracon, though, going to send that forward to no one. I'm going to take some weird bounces into midfield. Focus, is, uh, focus recovering the disc. Walking around on floor. Looking for his options, luring that defender out, passing it back to McBain. Looking to take their time on these passes. Looks like Spectral. Oh, they almost converted, but they just missed the net. And Adrenal or Spectral, I messed up the teams. Oh, my bad. And Spectral was able to get the clear, but no bad clear. And it looks like Adrenaline will have a moment to recover. Spectral does get to it first. Nope, the turnover. And a Spectral is able to eventually get the clear out into blue side. Adrenaline stacks, able to recover that disc very quickly. Coaster going to send that down through tunnel. Going to take some weird bounces into Spectral's zone. Coaster with the disc on the back wall. Shoots it in for the two. Goalie's sitting there dazed saying, what the heck just happened? Two points for Adrenaline. A minute in. Definitely a strong start that we expect to see from Adrenaline for this first matchup. Let's see what Spectral can do to really turn it around and maybe get a three to take the lead. Flair going to take the disc for Spectral, going up onto that ceiling. Going to juke out a little bit. Juking out one, drumming there, looking on the side. Flair's going to walk this one all the way through midfield. Passing it up. Oh, actually dribbling up. Coaster with the interception, though. Going to send that one back downfield. Looks like Snake will be able to recover, so we are going to keep it in Adrenaline's end. And they go for the shot. Let's see. Dunk. Oh, save in the adrenaline side and they are not able to get it cleared out so let's see if spectral can get a conversion for a three-pointer yeah good save there from coaster on adrenaline side unfortunately not able to get it out as it keeps going back into the hands of spectral as we've seen again drumming up to flare flare coming down gets stuffed by bane bane getting the clear almost actually off of the midfield geometry but going right back into the hands of spectral um, Dracon, oh, chasing the loose disc, Bane grabbing the, from the stack, going off of the bounce, off of the oh, floor, wait. for the three points, what a shot, and Adrenaline are up by five already, two minutes in, what a game. Adrenaline's really pushing it to them, taking advantage of uh, not having that main roster chemistry going on, and the reason why they do have that four game winning streak for them. Flair is going to grab the disc again, keeping one back just in case. And he does get stunned, so that is definitely needed. But the pass is able to get out and get clear down into Adrenaline zone. It goes to here, the backline player for Adrenaline. Sticking on the backline, hoping to get some defenders out. Going to walk it forward and send it up to his teammate, who's waiting for the pass. A little bit of a half-court shot. Just high, though. Coaster, though, with the disc. Actually losing it. And is back on the wall. Pass it up to Focus. Focus for the one one Takes a shot and a save from Drummond. Drummond going to slap the one out of here right into the back hands. Right back into the hands of Adrenaline. And Mini with the disc off the coaster. Coaster with the disc up to Focus. Focus for the one on one again and takes it in for the two. Goalie looks like it was stunned out. And that'll be another two points for Team Adrenaline. Wow, Adrenaline really pushing it to Spectral. Really showing who is the better team so far. Almost halfway through. 
Do we think Spectral can pull it out and take game one? Yeah, De Spectral definitely has a chance. There's still six minutes left in this game um, before, you know, the end of round one. Uh, they still have some time. It's a three-goal game. Looks like some jukes there from Flair. Gonna send that over to his teammate. So if they can keep control of this, this disc and uh, reduce those mistakes. Because we get another mistake from Snake. Bane taking it away and walking it up the field. Makes, takes a shot. Not close. Um, able to be recovered by Focus, though. Focus going to pass it up to his teammate, Bane. Juking around on the floor. Giving it up to Mini. Mini to Focus. What a passing play. Focus, stop from drumming. McBain, though, getting the stuff. And the two. What a play. It really just looks like Spectral is, or Spectral is just not as together as Adrenaline. Adrenaline is there to recover the passes a lot more frequently than Spectral. And at the end of the day, that's what's leading to these conversions just in the scramble. Adrenaline's ready to go. Flair once again getting the disc, but tossing it fast as he was expecting the stun. And it's Adrenaline's coming back. Two on one. Let's see if they can recover. He comes for the shot, comes in the bubble, goes for the cut pass, but it doesn't work out. And it looks like Spectral will be able to clear it out. Yeah, it's the same thing we've seen with some like some Joker teams or uh, teams facing Joker is there uh, teams like Kangorillas or Spaghetti or uh, whatever the team name now is. They'll make mistakes and then Joker will just capitalize. As we see again, Mini capitalizing on that mistake, taking the long shot, not in. But Spectral just making more mistakes and Adrenaline is using that to their advantage. And they're they're getting points out of it. So nine to zero, still five minutes left in the game. Bane passing it forward, one on zero, taking the anchor off the post. Face focus, still gonna take it in anyways, as there was no goalie left to defend. So another mistake. No one was able to get back in the bubble on adrenaline, just capitalizing and getting another two points on the board. Yeah, it looks like this is how it's gonna go for this first game. I. Spectral really just needs to push it together. What we can we expect in the second game really from a fundamental team chemistry level for uh, the Spectral game, I'm not sure because it looks like Adrenaline just has the better team cohesion once again getting the disc and able to clear it out, at least be there for the recovery. Uh, no one catching the recovery. Actually, Coach is going to send it back to goal. Mini there on the back line. Uh, I can look in chat, Glean saying... Yeah, goalies have been nuts this round, and that is very true. Coaster with a lot of saves, and Drummond Sam, a shot from half court. Not going in, unfortunately. Uh, as we see from Drummond, some good saves from Drummond, unfortunately not able to get it all the way out. But nonetheless, still some good stops from both goalies and both teams. So some good defense from both teams. Just not able to connect. Uh, Spectral like Snake on the open goal. Three points out of nowhere. It looks like no one got back from Adrenaline and Spectral. Capitalizing on their mistakes as well. I don't know, three and a half minutes left. Can they do it? Maybe with a few well-timed threes. Let's see what Adrenaline can come back with. This is the first time we see them with the disc advantage in this game. Many, uh, sorry, Focus gonna take the disc, going up on the ceiling again. Uh, Coaster gonna send that across. Uh, does not catch it and gets picked up by Spectral. So another mistake from Adrenaline. Spectral is capitalized, take the shot! A Coaster there for the save, what a stop. And Coaster going to send that out. That might be a huge stop. And Flair going to pick up the disc for Spectral. Looks like they are just going to reset the play here. Dracon just slowly walking up, take, trying to date someone out. But they, they do take the bait and are successful. And the turnover does happen for Spectral, uh, for Adrenaline rather. Let's see if Adrenaline can get the three. It is an open net. Takes the shot. Goes for the bounce. Oh, and he hits the post. Oh my gosh, what a game! No way, goalies are insane this game. It's definitely a goalies game. And let's see if Spectral can get the conversion off of the insane defense. Was that Snake who made that save? That was a great, great save from Snake. I thought that was Drummond, and I was like, wait, no, that's Snake on the on that backline end goal. Anyways, Flair here with the disc, passing it across to Dracon. Dracon losing the disc, mishandles it. Picked up by McBain. So again, another mistake from Spectral here. Able to recover, though. And looks like a reset to Drummond. Drummond gonna slap that forward to no one. And another loose disc in the Adrenaline zone. This looks like Adrenaline's game even still. Spectral was able to get the three in that momentum, but it looks like, oh, they miss the three, open three once again. But nevertheless, it is a time game at this point. And it looks like Adrenaline will just be, we're looking to take the time, go for the short passes and run down the clock. What can we expect Spectral to really change uh, for the second match? 
Well, right now they're making a lot of mistakes and they're not recovering very well enough. So getting those stacks back into their zone when they lose possession is really important for this team if they want to prevent those open threes. They've been a lot of open threes have been scored um, on Team Spectral. And uh, right now it looks like we're almost out of mathematical time. Let's score right now. Mini with the save and uh, three goal game. We are almost out of time. Focus with the slap forward. A couple seconds left before we're out. Coaster. Taking it up with the two on two. Takes the one on one with the goalie, makes it for the two. And that will end round one. Adrenaline taking the first round. What a game. Coaster going going end to end. 50 seconds left. What a first game. Was this really what we were expecting for this matchup? You know, Adrenaline with their four game win streak and Spectral, you know, not looking as clean? Or were we expecting Spectral to put up a little more of a fight? Um, well, I'd have to disagree with that, actually. They're putting up a great fight. Oh, the bounce shot from Coaster off the pyramid. Oh, my God. Okay, anyways. Um, I, they actually are, despite what the numbers say, 3-16, to 16, I, it, it's, it feels closer than that. There are a lot of good plays and a lot of good saves from both teams. So I, I feel like it's closer. The score just isn't telling the true story right now. I don't disagree. I'm really excited to see what uh, Spectral can do in this second matchup. Now that this first game's over, Kit, what have you noticed from these two teams after this first match? Adrenaline having like amazing stacks there. They just know how to read the plays. They're intercepting really well. The, there was a couple of amazing saves where they literally just pop out of nowhere, save the disc, clear it, and it's back in the other side of the field. There's some absolutely amazing clutch saves from Spectral as well. Just the, the saves across the board here. There's a, a save for every one of the players on orange side and two of the players on blue have saves as well. So like, it, it's very much a save game here. Like they're able to read the plays. Um, Adrenaline are just able to get it in the enemy bubble. And once they get it in the bubble, they have the passes to get it in the goal. And Orange and um, Spectral just don't know how to quite intercept that, I don't think, because Adrenaline is very, very strong in that bubble. Um, yeah, so Spectral have amazing plays, and they just... I, I'm absolutely amazed, because, like, both teams are doing so well. you think the score would be closer, but the scoreboard definitely doesn't show how hard these teams are fighting. It's yeah. definitely amazing to see. I couldn't yeah, agree more. <laughs> go ahead, Nick. Okay. Go ahead. We'll go into the first, the second round. Excuse me. We'll see who wins the wins this opening joust. Looks like again, adrenaline taking this one instead of headbutting. Oh, sneak from Snake. A little bit of a pun there. Uh, snake gonna send this one forward. Um, taking bounce off his shoulder. Um, no one to pick that up, unfortunately. And gonna get picked up by adrenaline. Yeah, adrenaline still putting on the pressure, keeping the adrenaline flowing. You gotta love those puns. Anyway, it looks like Spectral will be able to get to the disc first. And as Kit was saying, it really is a defensive game. It's both solid from both teams. Let's see if Spectral can really convert on those offensive opportunities in the second match. Yeah, McBain in the back line there, taking up the panic clear. Gonna send it back to Coaster. Coaster not grabbing it. Gonna take some more bounces in the upper trap. Snake coming away with it, slapping that one forward for Spectral. Miasi was able to get the clear. Oh, not quite. Spectral is able to recover. Awesome. Going for the pass, but it doesn't quite connect to Dracon. Let's see if he can at least pressure the bad pass. No, that looks like they go for a reset. And they are going to have that adrenaline pumping offense again. Hey, but Spectral is able to get the turnover. But it looks like there was just a scramble in the midfield. With Spectral winning it, going for the th three. But no, it looks like they aren't going to hit the shield. Yeah, so, uh, Adrenaline make another mistake. Panic clearing into the midfield geometry and Spectral able to receive the possession on that, although all, not able to connect on that long shot. Um, some more weird bounces again through midfield and it's going to float all the way down. The stack's done there for many and as the teams are going to float on down to recover this disc. Dracon getting the leech. Going on for the one-on-one. -on -one. Duking off of shoulder. Goes for the one takes the shot. Coaster with the headbutt save. Focus. Slapping it out. What a save from Coaster. 
What a save indeed. The defensive game is still strong. And it looks... Flair is coming in for the one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, and he Ooh. gets the dunk right on. And thank you, chat. It is Min Yasai. Not Mini. Uh, Min Yasai. For noted. Um, wow. Well, looks like that's exactly what we wanted to see from Spectral. Really taking it to Adrenaline's end. Let's see what Adrenaline has to say about it. Yeah, good underhand from uh, Spectral there, going under the goalie's hands and uh, connecting for that too. So for the first time, we've seen Spectral in the lead in round two. See how they can keep it for the rest of the round. Mini going to walk this one through tunnel. Or, sorry, Miniasi going to walk this run through tunnel. Caught myself. And Coaster going to re reset that to Coaster. Coaster going to send that one to Miniasi. Miniasi across to Focus. Focus holding it, walking it up. Goes under boot, takes the shot. Oh, actually, pass to McBain. Did not see him on the backboard. McGain going to slam that in for two points and is tied up in round two. New game, 0-0 zero, zero as far as I'm concerned, with seven minutes remaining. I believe in Spectral. Let's see the one. Let's take this round, and let's see. I want a game. I want a round three. What do you think, Knight? But yeah, definitely. This is way too good of a match to not go to round three. Dracon with the disc over to Flair. And Flair going to walk this one up a little bit. Sending it up to Snake. Snake not able to reach it. Short arms. T-Rex arms. And uh, is going to float back down in the zone. Minyasi looking to pick this one up. Getting a oh, block from Minyasi. And Minyasi going to send that one down field for Adrenaline. Stack's looking to pick that one up. Coaster. Looks like it will. Oh, but he misses. What a stun by the defensive Spectral. They are going to try for the cut pass, but it doesn't work out. Let's see. See if Adrenaline can recover. Nope. Spectral is able to get it and clear it downfield. Is it good? Yes, it is. And we're going to have a stack race once again with, with Coaster able to clear it out downfield once again for the Adrenaline offense. Yeah, good stuff there from Spectral. As you've seen, a lot of saves in this game don't count as saves because you're either stunning out the uh, the offending player who's trying to score, and it doesn't count as a save because the game only counts a save when you grab a disc that is heading towards the goal. So there are a lot of saves from both teams that are not being counted, and I'd like to note those. An open shot from Focus, punishing Spectral, not being ready for that save. And all of a sudden, it's two to five, five minutes left in this round. Wow. Wow. Adrenaline showing who is boss in this second round. I want a Spectral, get a three, let's find that offense. Flair, it, or Dracon actually grabs it and gets the clear. The stack is there, Flair gets it. Oh, but he gets knocked out and they will be able to turn it over. One second, no, bad clear. See what Spectral can do, but it looks like Adrenaline will be able to get the reset. No, they're not. Ooh, man, close midfield, but no, the clear eventually is good. Yeah, Coaster, we've seen a shot from Bane off the post. Um, uh, back in Coaster. Coaster is a really good goalie, but uh, not so good on the, the clears. He's been panic clearing a lot into the walls and has been going back into their own zone. That There's a good clear from Coaster, though. And uh, picked up by uh, Drummond Sam. He's going to clear that right through. It's going to get through everyone, actually. Um, all the way downfield. So, disc and adrenaline zone. Stack's there to pick it up. And Focus going to juke on the wall for a little bit to try to get this one out. Yeah, somehow he just gets it downfield. Adrenaline's always there to recover, but the defensive game for both teams is really strong. I really want Spectral to just find, can connect those passes. It's only a one-goal game. Looks like Dracon's going to go for it, Woo! and he gets the three for the 5-5 five, five tie with only a few minutes left. Go, Spectral, go. Wow, the lucky bounce is about off of bow tie, off of uh, Pac-Man and down to Dracon. Allowing him to take that shot does connect, and we're tied up four minutes left with Adrenaline on offense to see what they can do. What an exciting round two. This is exactly what we were looking for. Focus going for the pass. It is good. It is downfield. Bane has the disc. Is net open? No, it is covered, so they are going to go for the pass again. And Adrenaline once again has the re has the recovery. They just have the faster recoveries in the offensive zone. Going for the pass, three on one. Goalie is out, but so is Coaster. And the clear is good for Spectral. That might as well have counted as a save. What a stuff from Dracon. Out of nowhere, just stunning that offending player. Snake with the disc, with the one-on-one -on -one opportunity. Opting to pass it down to Flair. Flair looking to dunk it. I think the goalie got stunned. 
The Donk from Flare Spectro are up by two for the second time in this game. And it looks like we might be heading to a round three. I certainly hope so. And Spectral has anything to say about it. Only a few minutes left on the clock. I don't know how this is going to go, but I really hope it goes to a round three. This is exactly what we were looking to expect for a round two comeback from Team Spectral. Yeah, definitely. There is Spectral with a stack defense this time. Successfully steals that disc, although the headbutt from the teammate. Snake still with the disc. Shoots for the three, and it connects. And all of a sudden, Spectral are up by five points. Wow, Spectral really put it on the heat now. Something eventually clicked there uh, for this in the second round, especially with the sub in. I'm really wondering what Adrenaline's thinking right now as the momentum really is kind of pushing towards Spectral. Yeah, Spectral changing up their defense. You see they have that stack on Bowtie and it, and it worked and they got the disc, they got the three and they're up by five. And uh, so they changed it up again. So now they still have a stack in the back line. They're gonna chase after the disc here and uh, does not get it just yet. McBain, oh, getting stuffed by Dracon. Dracon getting stunned out and the pass back, the stack able to retrieve and clear it downfield. So good stack actually goes back into Adrenaline. Focus with the disc, setting it up to no one. Dracon with the disc, going to clear that one out. Forest Spectral goes all the way through, and uh, we'll see what they can do. The stack is there, but Flare just isn't able to quite get it, so the stack is able to get back for defense. They are setting up their offense here. I'm really excited to see what this looks like. Flare is able to get a shield. Oh. He gets around. Oh. oh, but just a little bit shorter pocket. Dracon is able to recover, get the pass up. Drunk Drummond is there to recover. Goes down to Flare. Flare does get stunned out. This offense is looking a lot better, although these passes aren't quite connecting. Going for the cut. Whoa, and he the gets the goal. goal. Oh, no. Coaster is almost there for the defense. But it looks like this might be Spectral's game. Knock on wood, Caster's curse, but one minute left. Few goal <laughs> game. I think it's good. Yeah, great offense and setup from Spectral. They're going to get back together. The pass from floor to floor to nest and off of Coaster's head. Adrenaline with the disc. Gonna juke off a uh, ceiling I've seen every time. Coaster gonna send that across to Minyasi. Minyasi gonna walk this one upfield. <laughs> Sending it down to McBain. Bane there to recover that. You're gonna get sent into the enemy bubble. Yeah, this defense is still on point for both teams. It really just looks like Spectral turned it on, turned on the heat, got the coordination going. And with 30 seconds left, I dare say that we're going to a round three, especially Spectral continuing the control, but a whole bit of a scuffle in the midfield. At the end of the day, Snake is able to walk away with it, walk into the bubble. Let's see if he's looking for a cut pass. Gets the pass. Oh, but he gets stunned, Flare. And it looks like that will be round two with a finishing 12-5 for Team Spectral. Wow, what a great round from Spectral. Bringing it back from that first round was like 3 to 16 or something. But what a, an amazing comeback after that huge score deficit in that first round. We're going to a round three. 100%. Kit, what do you have to say? What did Spectral really change to put on the heat? I think Spectral just found their momentum. I think they shook off the nerves. They said, right, we're not going to let this round get to us. We're going to come back absolutely blazing. They did. They, they came back with the stacks. They came back with a different strategy. Uh, they were able to just absolutely come back with a blazing force. They had a couple of amazing saves there and a couple of amazing steals and intercepts. Um, they, they just... Their defense was amazing, and then their defense to offense was just improved dramatically. Um, Adrenaline having some very good moments there as well. Um, of course, getting that headbutt save. Um, I love to see headbutt <laughs> save. They're, they're, they're so hard to get, so when it happens, it's just like, oh, wow, that that's amazing. Um, the, the, there was a couple of moments where they just read the situation and could intercept that disc. Um, beautiful work from both teams like it, it's a good game it's a close game it's just one team each round has just managed to get that little bit of an edge well let's see who has the edge in this round three as the launch is happening and it looks like adrenaline is going to win it with 
Coaster having the disc, looking for the pass, is able to pass it out. Oh no, it's a little bit off, but focus will we recover. It looks like not. And Spectral is taking that. Never mind. Turn around in the midfield. Net is open, and it is a three pointer. Adrenaline really showing who wants to win this game. Yeah, definitely. Adrenaline winning all three opening jousts for all three rounds. And the long shot through two defenders from Focus will start off this round three to zero. See what Spectral can do. All right, Spectral is gonna have a good pass this time. Here we go. Snake passing it up to Flare. Flare is able to get it one-on-one, -on -one, takes the shot, Ooh. is just a little bit high. And Flare and Snake are there ready to go again. Gets the what? knockout and gets the goal! Flare taking it to them for Team Spectral. Let's go. What a fadeaway from Flair. He's kind of floating away from goal, and Kobe's that in past the goalie. Not ready for it. Adrenaline on offense, looking to respond. What can they do? What can they do indeed? Focus is going to focus and look to see his options and really slow down the gameplay, taking advantage of their one-point lead, forcing Spectral to overcommit and get that pass on. And they do exactly that, but they aren't able to get the stun. And Bane is there to recover for the clear down into their end. Yeah, Spectral with the stack defense that we've seen before. They're chasing around the disc. It might pay off again. Snake almost getting a hand on it. Going to reset to Coaster, though. Coaster going to slow down the game a bit more. The disc is loose. Strikon looking to pick that one up. Big Bane coming away with it. Setting up to Focus. Focus getting stunned out. And Flair going to recover that, sending that downfield. Adrenaline just is always there. Oh, no, Whoa. but he gets stunned. Snake has an option for the three mail <laughs> slot. No, so close. Oh. And it is going to get dunked back out. Dracon there is there to recover, looking for the pass. Snake is low. Flare is high. Who is he going to go? He's going to walk it in, go for the dunk, and he gets oh, it. Oh, my God. With putting Spectral in the lead for the first time this round three. What a shot from Dracon, putting that lead up to one. We're still only three minutes into this round. We have a lot of time left to see these teams, two teams duke it out. Adrenaline gonna start with the disc this time. Focus taking it up to ceiling as we've seen before. I'm gonna juke it around a little bit, looking for his options. The stack defense again from Spectral. We're gonna chase that disc around. Yeah, Adrenaline's really taking a good amount of time, really just focusing on what's important and playing down that time game. But it looks like it's not working out for them this game. Spectral has all the nice passes. Let's see if they can get the convert it. Goes for the cut to Flare. Flare takes the shot, but oh, they are there. Flare still has control. Goes for back, but no. Hits the post, and they are going to come and reset for this pass back into the bubble, but it looks like it will be cleared out. Yeah, Flair with two shot opportunities there, almost getting it in, but dinging both times. Very close to getting it in. There was a lot of pass options open. Unfortunately, did not take any of those. And is back in the hands of Adrenaline. Adrenaline looking to take the lead with this next opportunity. Minyasi taking the shot. The stop, though, from Drumming and the slap from Snake. That is going to get stopped at mid. Coaster going to pick it up for Adrenaline. And we're back on offense for Adrenaline here. Let's see, they're going into the bubble, but Focus just misses that pass, and they are able to get the clear. Spectral with these turnovers, I feel like that's what they really were able to get in this last couple rounds, and it looks like an open three, and they got it. Flair converting, making their lead to, bringing their lead to four. Wow, good job Spectral on really pushing the game into the other end these last couple rounds. Yeah, as you said earlier, the def something definitely clicked for this team. They're seeing all the mistakes and they're capitalizing on it. Spectral is taking every chance they have to get points on the board. And so far, they're just doing it. They are putting points on the board. It's seven to three. And they're just, they're, they're looking for those mistakes now. And uh, it's definitely paying off for them. Yeah, and Snake is able to get the stun once again. Going for the reset. Oh no, it's a bad pass. Oh no, it's <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm so glad it didn't, but Adrenaline is there to recover. With the reset pass to Coaster, really just taking a look, seeing who's open, going to bounce down. Bane put pass and cut and focus. Oh, but it is saved. Wow, what great defense and offense, both end to end for Spectral. 
Dracon with the hands. Everyone with the hands on Team Spectral. It looks like a team of goalies over here stopping every single opportunity that they have to score. Adrenaline with another chance to score on Team Spectral, but Spectral just stopping it. Coaster with the disc, sending it across to his teammate. Looking for a two-on-two. -two. McBain taking it up. His hands from Drummond. Drummond unstoppable. Coaster, though, with the pickup for the two. And this is a close game, seven to five, with uh, five minutes left. This is what we're looking for in every series. Take notes, everyone, because this is the, why we play this game. Spectral having judged advantage, two points up, but a, with a one goal game, half of it left, it's anyone's game. Dracon is able to get the clear. It is good all the way down. Looks like that they are gonna be able to reset and have the aggressive uh, offensive advantage for Adrenaline, really slowing down the pace compared to Spectral's offense, just from going for those long, slow passes. But this is far from long and slow, going for the pass mid, but oh, going post, going for the hook shot, but doesn't seem to quite be on target. Going for the pass again, Ooh, and Minyasai closing it out, tying the game with only a few minutes left. Great pass from Focus to Minyasi on the shield and getting that two pointer for Adrenaline, tying it up. Um, as you mentioned earlier, the slow playing from Adrenaline, they're changing up their strats and it didn't work too well for them in round two, but it might be paying off here as the Spectral takes the disc, Dracon with it, sending it to right tunnel. Yeah, it looks like Adrenaline really changed their pace here and go for the really slow pace oh! in person, but the slow doesn't always, isn't always better. And Spectral is able to get a conversion, but Dracon does get punched out, was not able to recover it. Coaster going in, taking a look, finding the passing lane, trying to bait one out. He does. Focus resetting to Minyasai, walking it in. Back to Focus. Focus going back. Oh, not quite able to connect on the backboard. And they are able to get the clear. No, they're not. Oh, my goodness. Two on one. Pass one on one. Ah, oh, doesn't quite connect. And Spectral is finally able to get the clear. It might bounce in. That might. Oh, off the shield. Flare the pick up for the two points. We're up by two. Oh, my gosh. But noting on that, that last play, Coaster getting out. Not sure what happened tonight or if it's me, uh, but he did cut out. But Coaster absolutely playing insane. Wow, what a game and what a turnaround for Spectral. Focus is still playing that slow game, but Spectral is having none of it, going for the pass, fast re-grab stack. Woo! Minyasai coming back, going for the pass, resetting it to Coaster. Coaster just looking for the pass, looking for the three. Two minutes left on the clock. Doesn't quite connect to Bane. They're in the bubble. They're going for the dunk and they get it! 9-9! Nine, nine. One minute, 55 on the dock. Let's get it. Man, what a close round three. Um, Who? I'm, I'm at game disconnected, so I cannot see. Uh, Luke, you want to take this while I reconnect real quick? Absolutely. Wow, what a game to go. Two minutes left. Spectral having the disc, Dracon going for the pass, up to Flare. Oh, he gets punched out, not quite able to get the shot he wanted, but that's okay. Snake is there, ready to recover, taking a look, taking a book out of Adrenaline, slowing it down, looking for the right passes, going for the high percentage plays, but oh no, right in front of the net, the stack, and he gets it! Oh my goodness, what the miss passed and the punishment. McBain there to finish it, 11-9. For Adrenaline with only one minute remaining. Let's see what Spectral can do with the disc. Yeah, wow. definitely. I'm loading back in the game. And I see a two-pointer from Adrenaline. Spectral was up. Now they're ahead. 9 to 11. One minute left. Dracon with the disc. Looking for his pass option. Setting it to right tunnel. Flare. Passing it up. Missing the disc. A snake might even bounce in. Minyasi taking possession. Going to clear that to midfield. Dracon picking it up. Looking for his options. Sending that. Oh, get stunned out by McBain. McBain now with the disc. 30 seconds left in the round. Spectral have to get the disc. Now Minyasi with the open uh, goal. And that'll end the round. Adrenaline. Uh, no. Taking the game with that three. Wow, what a game. What a game indeed. Minyase really closing it out. I think this game is done. But what a close game. Spectral, even with the sub, really 
giving it to Adrenaline with their four game win streak, now five. But GG's to both teams and just everything that both these teams have switched around. Kit, anything you'd like to add? Both teams just came out absolutely blazing in that third round. Both teams killing it. They did such a good job. It was so close. It was so back and forward. Just little mistakes. Like, little mistakes on both sides just caused turnovers. And both teams had amazing bubble plays in that last section. They could read where the situation was going. And uh, those saves, it's just insane to see. Like, both teams doing an amazing job to just keep those saves up and I'm mind blown because of the amazing job that they have done. 100% what great game uh, especially for uh, Night and I's first cast. Uh, we will be joining you just again here on VRML 3 in just a second for another game. We're going to switch out the cameraman but um, that's all for me Knight. Anything to close it out? Oh yeah, definitely. Some of the stats here make Bane with 94 stuns. Wow, that is insane. Also, Focus coming away with 12 points. McBain and Coaster with nine. Minyasi with five. And Spectral, Snake with six. Dracon with five points. Snake with three assists though, and it's five saves from Drum and Sam. An insane game from both teams. In insane game indeed. All right. See you soon. We'll be back shortly.